In the early 20th century, scientific breakthroughs set the stage for the atomic bomb. In 1938, German scientists Otto Hahn and Fritz Strassmann discovered nuclear fission in uranium, splitting atoms to release immense energy, as explained by Lise Meitner and Otto Frisch. This sparked global interest. By 1939, Albert Einstein and Leo Schillard warned President Roosevelt of Nazi Germany's potential to weaponize fission, prompting U.S. action. The Manhattan Project, launched in 1942, centralized U.S. efforts under General Leslie Groves. J. Robert Oppenheimer led the scientific team at Los Alamos, New Mexico. Over 130,000 people across sites like Oak Ridge, Tennessee, uranium enrichment, and Hanford, Washington plutonium production worked in secrecy. Two bomb designs emerged. Little Boy, a uranium-235 gun-type bomb, and Fat Man, a plutonium-239 implosion device. Enrichment was key. Oak Ridge processed 50 kilograms of U-235, while Hanford produced 60 kilograms of plutonium by 1945. Challenges were immense. Refining fissile material, ensuring chain reactions, and solving implosion mechanics. By July 16, 1945, the Trinity test in Alamogordo, New Mexico, detonated a plutonium bomb, yielding 21 kilotons of TNT-equivalent energy. Weeks later, on August 6 and 9, Little Boy 15 kilotons and Fat Man 21 kilotons struck Hiroshima and Nagasaki, killing tens of thousands instantly. The project, costing $2 billion, reshaped warfare and geopolitics. The atomic bomb was born from scientific genius, wartime urgency, and moral ambiguity, its legacy still debated.